What's good, y'all? It's Teresa Jay here for another video, and today I'm actually just being a brother sharpening another brother. I am out here, I'm encouraging my brother, teaching, helping. You know, I'm not really teaching because he pretty much knows what to do, but it's like encouraging him in the areas that he needs to be encouraged. And it's really cool to see this process because, in a way, he's reminding me of how I was when I first started content creating. Um, this YouTube channel, yeah, I. I, this is more of a recent thing, but I've been consecrating since high school. So when it came to transitioning it to the Lord, I already had the tools and resources to actually do it. And I've already had like the practice. So just to see my brother, like even go through the, the multiple edits thing is so cool because it's like, wow, I was just here. And it's encouraging to, to even be brought back to that space because it's actually humbling to to see that. But y'all, this is like a continuation of the Iron Sharpening Iron series, to be honest. Um, just being here is all he kind of needed with the encouraging and stuff like that. And by me giving him this time, um, he's actually able to just walk in the call that he asked for, that God has for him, right? And even uh, the Lord has given me like a prophetic gift to see, see people, um, see pe where people are going and stuff like that. And to speak into that identity and just to see um, Isaac start to walk in that is just amazing and encouraging. And I'm just excited to see where it goes. Like, I see where you're at now and I see where it's going to go. And, you know, it's so exciting. Um, yeah, a nice younger brother moment. So, yeah, I'm going to get back over there. And y'all saw a little bit of B-roll, but y'all might see a little bit more. Hopefully he got some of the video done now. <laughs> yeah, let's get Come it. Come up to us and talk about certain things. And they have been having some spiritual breakthrough within their heart. Their heart is being transformed. Our heart is being continuously transformed even as we're proclaiming and preaching the gospel. Hey y'all. Oh, we. Hey, mm, we're gonna have to be on that, that way. That way oh. where the light is. Let me see. Oh, how do I do it? Move your finger from behind the thing. Oh, it's oh, it's recorded? Mm -hmm. It's still black, bro. Oh, we. We black, black. Uh -oh. Uh, black, 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 black. What's going on with this auto? Black, black. Oh, oh, oh. Well, blacky, black, black, black. All right. So Isaac, <laughs> um, I was telling him how how this is like the continuation of the iron sharpened iron, yeah. and how like the Lord gives me the prophetic gift to see people in like walking in their callings yeah. and just to see it for ourselves was just like so exciting because it even reminded me of when I first started um so hmm, the Lord is good the <laughs> I, I that's all I got was. cause I'm really like too oh what's your question oh I so would, just, you're answering it <laughs> oh like honestly I wanna say I wasn't nervous, like I know the assignment, I know the calling, I wasn't nervous, but I just felt like I had so much joy on the inside to where I couldn't really express it, if that makes sense. Like, I couldn't really express what God was telling me to do. And, cause I genuinely didn't feel nervous, I just felt overwhelmed. Mm. Like because the weight of the call, the basically. The call. That, that's what that's that's what it is now. Yeah, no, nah, it, it felt good to release it. Time. Nah, for real. <laughs> it, it, it felt good to release it, but it was just so like, Huh? Straight outside. Oh. It felt good to release it, but it was just definitely like, oh, but like that. Mm. Oh. It's fine. It's yeah. Like that. It felt good to release it. It just felt heavy. Like burning some. Like burning some. I guess I felt how Paul felt in what book was that? I don't remember, but he was going to talk to them and he felt grief for what they was doing. Mm. To where he was like, he was like, um, I wanna laugh. I don't know why. <laughs> He was okay. like, Joe, um, you can let it out. What did Paul say? He basically was saying that, Lord, forgive me on, on their behalf or something like that to what he was saying. Hey, um, she's so pretty. Thank you. Don't look at the doggy. She's so cute. But, um, yeah, so he just felt grieved that would him going to talk to that church, it really gave him a heavy heart to know that they, it, I think it was them that was, hmm, I don't know. I'm gonna I'm get that scripture, but yeah. 
So yeah, I just felt I just felt heavy hearted. That's all. I love doing it. I, I did. And then um, having a you, brother. Did right you feel here a little bit more free when I walked away? <laughs> no. 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 It was it's it's genuinely just So the Holy Spirit had me leave for a different reason then. He probably did have you leave for that. But hmm, it could have been. But like me, I just don't know how it feels. Like, I felt him keeping me calm too. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Um even though like I said, I don't I don't know. It's hard to explain. When the words come, when the Lord revealed the words to me, when he give the words to me, y'all will know. Y'all will <laughs> know. The camp. It, it, it yeah, because I'm pointing don't, at this. Don't, don't look at that. Right. I got to get used to this, bro. This this is... Even on your phone, you got to uh, look at, at the dynamic island and not the... Not yeah, because I be looking at myself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, that's why it's best for you to do it on the back camera. Yeah. What's up, man? But yeah, God is good, bro. Ooh, we got a spider web on me. <laughs> no, no, no. Um. So, yeah. I think also the Holy Spirit had me walk away so I can stop because I, I felt myself wanting to, because, you know, because I wanted to be like, okay, do it like this because, you know, it works out like this. I, yeah. I, it's like a trial and error. You got to let me go through trial and error. Yeah. Uh, and then I am, mm, never mind. That would have been like boasting, I guess. So, no, I rebuke that. That would have been pride. I had to rebuke that. I rebuke mm. that. Yeah. But yeah, it's good to also have a brother which. Well, let me say brethren, because, you know, that means male and female. But it's good to have somebody with you that is also in the Lord so that you can feel that reassurance while the Lord is also reassuring you. And definitely if you, like, mess up on the scripture, that person, you know, sometimes you just sigh out and be like, mm, no, that ain't the one. <laughs> I, I felt like that's that's something that helps me, too, because it brings me back to what it'll bring you, it'll bring you and the person back to what y'all are initially talking about or to what the topic is. And just sometimes, you know, you have to let the Holy Spirit flow. Yeah. Um, this is a new season for me recording. It's a new season. Yeah. It's a new day. But yeah, thanks. Thanks, brother. Thanks, no brother. Thank you, Lord, too. I really do thank you. The Lord has graced me for. You know what? We're going to talk about this offline. All right. Because. Um, but yeah, um, Jade, Alexa, y'all getting this next. Yeah, y'all next. Y'all next. Y'all next. Y'all next. Uh huh. Y'all next. Y'all next. Uh, but yeah, if y'all like this video, uh, yeah, God be the glory. I don't care. I'm not doing the outro thing. Bye. Yeah, amen. <laughs> Never I start doubting, losing faith and drowning. I'll just start running, running to you. Take me places that I've never been before Show me proof that I really am restored And I know that there always is more Keep on running